Hey guys, I hope you're doing well. Happy Monday. <laughs> it is November 1st, which is awesome, which means I have my monthly favorites to be putting out. Hopefully that video will go live tomorrow. But today I wanted to try on some of my new lipstick products. So BK Beauty, Lisa J Makeup, just released her new lipsticks and I picked up a couple. I didn't pick up all of them. I think there's five lipsticks in all and I picked up three. I think there's four lip liners. I picked up one, but I figured I wanted to share with you guys what I thought about them, put them on my lips and show you what they look like. Let's talk about them. So let's jump in and get started. I do not have them on my lips right now. I have something else on. So let me wipe this off and I'll be right back. All right, let's start with the lip liner. I only bought one of these. I was tempted to buy more, but this seemed to be the color that I would wear the most knowing my taste in lip liner. So I picked up the shade called Warm Spice. So here is what it looks like, what the pencil looks like. And it is a mechanical one, so it just um, does not sharpen, but rather it just twists up and it twists up just like this. And it has at this interesting angle, which I think is cool. I've never seen a lip liner at this angle before. It's a little bit dirty right now, sorry. Already been using it, so. So this is Warm Spice, let me swatch it on my hand. I'll tell you a little bit about the formula. This right here is $12, is the lip liner price, and that's pretty good, I think. That's really, really a pretty good price. I think MAC is like, 18 or $19. Anyway, this is described as a rich pigmented lip liner that glides on like a dream while keeping lips soft and moisturized throughout the day. It has shea butter for smooth application. It is formulated without parabens, sulfates, or phthalates, and it is 100% cruelty free. So let's try this on my lips, see what we think. It is really smooth, easy to put on, doesn't drag at all. And this is what it looks like all over the lips. So it looks kind of like a brownie, red, darker brick color. So I'm not really sure what to compare it to. I think Lisa J said similar to like Max Spice. I don't know, I don't own that one. So it's a little bit unique to the lip liners that I have just because it is kind of like a brownie red color. So a little bit deeper than most of the lip liners that I have, but really pretty. It isn't like, I can't, you know, move my lips while I have it on. It's very matte and it's very just dried down already. It's not like I can move it. But this is Warm Spice on my lips. It's really nice. So I'm gonna leave this swatch on my hand and just see how long it wears. So we'll leave that on there. And then let me take this off and we're gonna put on some of the lipstick. So these are the three, three colors that I bought. I bought Inner Beauty, Kindness, and Acceptance. So let's describe these really quick. They're creamy, long lasting, and packed with pigment. All BK Beauty Luxe lipsticks are infused with apricot oil to nourish and moisturize your lips throughout the day. So very moisturizing formula claims to be. And this one is Inner Beauty. That's the first one. This one is like the pinkiest of all of them. And let's put this one on. So smooth going on, not like a tug at all. So smooth, the formula is so smooth and creamy, so completely hydrating. I think it looks nice on the lips. I think Lisa said this is like the perfect wedding shade. So it's like a nice, your lips but better kind of pinky shade, so creamy. It definitely leans more pink than it does brown or neutral but really pretty easy to wear. I can see how this goes with everything and I think this is great. I think I would just love to have a lip liner with it. I think it would look better with a lip liner in my opinion, on my lips anyway. 
But these are so great and these cost $22 a piece. I mean, that is a great price. Let's check out this packaging too. It's a really nice bullet. It's kind of like a longer bullet than traditional lipstick and it just slides in there. It's magnetized, it's beautiful. There is her little logo on the top and then on the bottom it just says the color and details about the lipstick. It just rolls up like this. It's a great, easy to use product. It is so nice and you just roll it right back down and I love the magnetic closure. It's just really nice, slim component. Very, very nice. So this is Inner Beauty. All right, now let's take off Inner Beauty and try on the next one. All right, the next one I'm gonna put on for you is in the color Acceptance. And this one is more of like a creamy pink color, I would say, like a lighter pink. I guess this one would be maybe a little bit more neutral, but I think both of these are pretty pink if I have to say so myself. So let's try on acceptance. This is acceptance on my lips. I would definitely wear this with a lip liner. I think it's a little bit too light for me. And I would pull both this one and the first one down with like a brown lip liner. So I really think this would probably be the best lip liner. Let me see how this layers over this color. So really quickly, here's acceptance. And now let's try to layer warm spice over acceptance. All right, this is Warm Spice layered over acceptance. I think it's moving in the right direction. I'm not sure that this layers as well as I would have hoped it would. I love a lip liner that layers over lipstick really well because oftentimes I put on the lipstick first and then decide I want a lip liner. I don't know if this is exactly the look I'm going for. I bet it looks a lot better under and then blended. That's probably what would look best. I mean, I think these are both great products. I'm just not sure layered lipstick and then liner is really the look that I'm looking for. But let's take this off. We'll play around with layering them in just a minute, but let's get to the last lipstick in kindness. All right, the last lipstick is kindness. And this is definitely like more of just a beigey peach color, which is right up my alley. I kind of saved the best for last, my favorite. So let me swatch this one for you. There it is. Once again, $22 for this one as well. Let's slap this on and I'll tell you what I think. So this is like the same as the last one. It's a little bit too light without a liner. I definitely think this would look so much better with a liner. I don't know, I'm just not used to seeing myself without a liner <laughs> or with darker lips or something. This just looks a little off to me, but it's definitely my favorite color of the bunch and it's the most neutral in my opinion. Once again, feels awesome, feels really creamy. These have a great smell to them too. It's just like a sweet lipsticky smell. It's nothing annoying at all. It's really light, but it has a great fragrance. So here it is. This one is my favorite in kindness. Okay, so now we're gonna play with layering. Let me wipe this one off. I'm gonna put on the lip liner and then we're gonna put kindness on, blend it in and see what we think. Warm spice. Okay, when I put this on, I'm gonna blend this out a little bit so it's not like harsh edges. Now let's put kindness in the center. Oftentimes I find like it's best to kind of just pat the lipstick on instead of like swiping it on. So that's what I'm going for.
that is a perfect combination. So Warm Spice and Kindness is like my perfect lip. This is it. If I knew how to stay within the lines, this would be perfect. <laughs> I'm only human over here, guys. It's really comfortable. I know that I'm going to love these for a long time. I can't wait to play with them with more combinations, different lip liners, different lip glosses, all the above. So I'm really happy with these purchases. I hope this was helpful. Once again, let's go over the colors. This was Warm Spice. Then we have Inner Beauty. We have Acceptance and kindness my favorites in warm spice i really like that as well let's see how this lip liner held up mm, it's very blendable so it's not like you know really really locking into my lips or not really locking into my skin so i guess it's just like kind of a movable long lasting formula anyway it's really nice so far i just wanted to get on here and show you guys and let you know my thoughts these definitely have a thumbs up for me and i'm very happy with my purchases i think you guys will love them try them out all right see you later bye